So now let's see the differences between the capital receipt and revenue receipt. So capital receipt refers to the receipt of non-recording non nature such as additional, additional capital from owner, loan raised by the firm and money obtained from the sale of fixed asset. On the other hand, revenue receipt, revenue receipt are those receipts obtained during the normal course of business operation and are recurring in nature. The example of capital expenditure are sale of a capital receipt. The example of capital receipt are sale of fixed asset, capital introduced by the owner, loan taken by the firm. So these are the example of capital receipt. And revenue receipt, the example are sale proceeds of goods and services, interest received, dividend received, rent received are the examples of revenue receipt. Capital expenditure, uh, capital receipt, capital receipt are shown in the liability side of balance sheet. Like loan raised, loan is shown in the, if loan is raised, capital introduced by the owner. So these are the liability side of the balance sheet. So capital receipt are shown in the liability side of balance sheet. Whereas uh, revenue receipt, it is shown in the, revenue receipt are shown in the either trading account or profit and loss account. This is the revenue receipt. Now, if you see the uh, differences between the uh, differences between capital expenditure and the revenue expenditure, differences be distinction between the capital expenditure and revenue expenditure are capital expenditure incurred for acquisition of or erection of any fixed assets that is utilized in the business. So. This is the difference. On the other hand, revenue expenditure is a day-to-day -day expenditure that is done for the conduct of the business. Whereas capital expenditure is incurred for acquisition or erection of any fixed asset. Whereas revenue revenue expenditure are those expenditure they are incurred day-to-day -day expenditure. So capital expenditure will incur the earning capacity. Cap like capital expenditures increase increase the earning capacity of the business whereas revenue expenditure does not increase the earning capacity of the business but in, but it helps to run the business smoothly okay so capital expenditures the benefit of capital expenditure is extended more than one year but the benefit of revenue expenditure extend, un, extends only within the current year so this is the difference from the accounting point of view, capital expenditure are shown in the asset side of balance like building purchase, machinery purchase, furniture purchase, they are the capital expenditure and these asset purchase are, these assets are shown in the asset side of balance sheet. But whereas revenue expenditure, revenue expenditure are shown in the trading account or in the profit and loss, loss account. So, so from the accounting point of view, revenue expenditure are shown in the either in the trading account or it is shown in the profit and loss account. So this is the difference between the capital expenditure and the revenue expenditure. And we have also talked about the deferred revenue expenditure. So deferred revenue expenditure are those expenditure that refers to those expenditure. It is a revenue expenditure, but the benefit of which extends beyond the accounting year. That means the expenditure is done in one accounting year, but the benefit of that expenditure is enjoyed in the other subsequent year also. For example, such for example of this deferred revenue expenditure is ad advertisement expenses, heavy expenses incurred in advertising or launching a new product. The expenses incurred by the firm while launching the new product or at the time of the farm opening or launch at the time of the inauguration of the farm at the, the when the when the business when the company is putting for the first time or any new product is produced the company advertised that product that advertisement expenses on that is a very heavy expenditure and that 